Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and today's video is going to be using the Galaxy Chic palette it's from BH Cosmetics to achieve this look. So I hope you guys enjoy this video and keep on watching. Right here I'm priming the lids using Urban Decay Primer Portion. And then I'm going to jump into a color tattoo eyeshadow in the shade Pomegranate Punk as my base. I'm placing that all over the lid. And then going in, going in with a Makeup Geek Shadow in Creme Brulee, I'll be blending the edges out. Now jumping into the Galaxy Chic Palette, I'll be taking the shade Aphrodite and placing that all over the lid. And of course, blending the edges out using Creme Brulee. It's a lot of blending in this tutorial. Now jumping back into the Galaxy Chic palette, I'm going into the shade Prometheus and then I'll place that all over the lid as well. And of course, I'm blending the edges out. Now here I'm going in with the BH Party Girl palette, taking the black shadow from that palette placing it on the outer part of the eye and slightly putting it up into the crease halfway. I'm just placing the shadow there for now and then I'm going to go in with the blending brush and blend and diffuse that black out. Going in with Makeup Geek's Cupcake, I'll place that in the crease as well. And then I'm going to be going back into Prometheus and just putting that on the inner part of the lid. Just in case you lost that with all the blending. And using any white shadow, I'm going to put that on your brow bone as your highlight shade. Going in with Milky Way, I'll be placing that in the inner corner of the eye as my highlight shade. Now jumping back into Pomegranate Punk, I'm going to place that on the lower lash line. And then you're going to take the shade Aphrodite from the Galaxy Chic palette and place that all over the lower lashes. And then using the shade Cupcake by Makeup Geek, you want to blend that shadow out. Now jumping back into the black shadow, you're going to put that all over the outer part of the eye, wrapping it around, connecting it to the top, and then just blending it out. I'm going in with my favorite gel liner of all times. It's the Inglot number 77 Black Gel Liner. And I'm just putting that all over the lash line. No winging today. I'm going in with Max Smolder Pencil. I'll be tight lining and putting that in the waterline as well. And here I'll just be curling my lashes. And today's choice of mascaras is the Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara. And the... What is this one? from their real mascara from Benefit. Now I'm going in with my contour and today's bronzer is going to be by Sephora in Fancy Deep Number 3. In the usual, you guys know how we do it. Then as blush, I'm using Iris from BH Cosmetics. And you want to very light handedly place this on the outer part of the cheeks. Jumping into highlight, I'll be using Soft and Gentle by MAC. Putting that on the higher points of the cheeks, the bridge of the nose, on the cupid bow, and the chin and the forehead. I'm going to take a clean powder brush and just blend everything up. For our lips today, we're going to be using Revlon's Matte Balm in the shade 215 Shameless. My favorite one out of the whole collection. And on top of that, I'm going to be putting Mix's Butter Gloss in the Raspberry Tart. 
just finished the lips out and then I'm gonna take some concealer and clean the edges up just to make the lips look more clean and crisp and then I'll be setting the face with fix plus from Mac and that's the end of the tutorial I hope you guys enjoyed this video as much as I did creating it for you guys and to all my new subscribers welcome and I hope you'll be staying for a long time and that's it hope you guys enjoyed this video remember to give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't and that's it guys so I will be seeing you in my next video bye Behind.